welcome to the thorough newspaper analysis for 1st December 2022. So today we do not have any editorial article to discuss upon and instead we'll be focusing on the news upgrade and the legal news. Firstly, we have the Great Barrier Reef to be put on in the in danger list. Now, Australia's Great Barrier Reef should be listed as a World Heritage Site that is in danger, a UN panel recommended saying that the world's biggest coral reef ecosystem was significantly impacted by climate change and warming of the oceans. Secondly, we have UK India Business Council's Doing Business in India Report 2022. UK businesses in India have rated Maharashtra as the highest among states in terms of operating environment, followed by Gujarat, which is very famous for the gift city, Chandigarh, Haryana, Himachal Pradesh, and Andhra Pradesh, followed by Uttar Pradesh, as per the UK-India Business Council annual Doing Business in India Report 2022. Thirdly, we have the retail e-rupee pilot. Now, the Reserve Bank of India will launch the first pilot for the retail version of the central bank digital currency exactly a month after it started a pilot for the digital rupee wholesale segment. Fourthly, we have the Day of Remembrance of All Victims of Chemical Warfare. The Conference of the State Parties to the Chemical Weapons Convention at its 20th session decided that a Memorial Day for Remembrance of All Victims of Chemical Warfare would be observed on 30th November of each year or when appropriate, on the first day of the regular session of the conference. This commemoration provides an opportunity to pay tribute to the victims of chemical warfare as well as to reaffirm the commitment of the organization for the prohibition of chemical weapons to the elimination of the threat of chemical weapons, thereby promoting the goals of peace, security, and multilateralism. Fifth, we have the Who Remains Monkeypox is MPOX. The World Health Organization announced that MPOX is now the preferred name for monkeypox. Both names will be used simultaneously for one year while monkeypox is phased out, the organization said. Sixth, we have the World AIDS Day. This year's theme for World AIDS Day is Rock the Ribbon. The National AIDS Trust is committed to stopping new cases of HIV, securing the rights of people living with HIV and fighting HIV stigma and discrimination. We move on to the legal upgrades for today. We have one kilometer ESZ rule won't apply to Tungeshwar Wildlife Sanctuary near Mumbai, holds the Supreme Court. Now, the Supreme Court, in the case of TN Godavarman versus the Union of India, clarified that its order mandating one kilometer eco sensitive zone around protected forests will not apply to Tungeshwar Wildlife Sanctuary located near the suburbs of Mumbai. Sanjay Gandhi National Park and Thane Creek Flamingo Sanctuary are also exempted from the one kilometer ESZ rule. So with this, we come to an end for today's rendition of the thorough newspaper analysis. For free study materials and TNA PDS slides, please feel free to join our Telegram channel, the link of which you can find in the description, or you can always scan the barcode that is given on your screen. For any further information, please feel free to visit www.lawseeker.com. Thank you.